right, we're out here in Lavernia at VZ Environmental, and we're going to launch a weather balloon way up high into the sky. And uh, the kids are just so, you guys excited, right? Yeah. All right. I've got Natasha Wilkerson with me. She's a STEM director over at Communities and School. And look, Natasha, this is the second balloon. Where is the first balloon right now? So we're actually tracking it live. We have a GPS tracker on it. It's headed to Belmont right now. Okay, so kind of east of here. Exactly. And as you would imagine, because we've got a north wind, the balloon went up and then caught the winds that are coming from the south and west. And so it's going to end up probably around Brenham, Texas, somewhere around there, right? Yep, Brenham, Texas. So as soon as we're done here, we're going to get in a van. We're going to drive about two and a half hours and go get our balloon. All right. You know, this is really exciting. What kind of instruments do you have on this balloon? So on the balloon, we have two GoPro cameras because we want to capture the whole thing. Uh, the kids have a GPS tracker on there to make sure we get it back. Right. They also have a flight computer measuring temperature pressure data the whole way up so we know oh. where we're at and what's happening in the atmosphere. Mm -hmm. And they've also made 3D models. So they have little models that represent their school on the payload. All right, so we're going to find out a lot from these balloons as they go up. Now, I've got a student with me. What, what's your name again? Matthew Sol. Okay, and uh, i got to ask you, how much helium does it take to launch this up to about 60 to 80,000 feet? About 80 cubic inches, uh, cubic feet. 80 cubic feet, that's a lot of healing. Mm -hmm. All right, and uh, have you have you enjoyed this? Yes. Have, what, what, what have you learned so far? I've learned a lot of stuff, how to create stuff and how to build and think of brilliant ideas. Brilliant ideas, we're all about that, right? Well, I think we've got to make the final preparations and then we're gonna launch the second balloon. I can't wait. To see, I, I have a feeling it's probably going to go that way, but we'll find out. And uh, so make the final preparations. Let me do a little, are we ready? Okay, let me do a little weather and then we'll come back and, we will, and we'll launch this. Okay, all right, it is chilly out here in Lavernia. We've got temperatures in the 40s all across South Central Texas. And uh, we've got a lot of cloud cover out here. North wind at 12 miles per hour. Now here's what's interesting. The threshold is 15 miles per hour for this balloon to be able to have a successful launch. Anything above that, you won't be able to launch it. So we're really close, but I think the winds are um, gonna be enough, we'll be okay. So temperatures all across the area in the 